<laughs> All right, you ready to help me can some corn? Okay, I'm gonna give you in charge of the salt, okay? okay. See how I have one scoop? Okay. Put one scoop in that jar. And then put them in all these jars, okay? One scoop in each jar. Very carefully, please. I don't want salt everywhere. Then I got my corn that I got on a really good deal. It was 10 ears of corn for a dollar. So I think that's spectacular. Mommy, I put in one in Yeah, one in each jar. Thank you. And we have this lovely corn. So, of course, I grabbed like 40 ears of this corn. All right. Off camera, I'm just shucking it into a bowl. The... Uh, um, the chickens love the silk and the ducks love the husks, so none of that will go to waste. It will all get used. You doing good, girlfriend? Yeah? All right. I got two bowls here. I got a big bowl and a smaller bowl. I just put it upside down. Put the corn on it. Because it's easier to cut this way. And I cut off the corn and it falls into the bigger bowl. And it all stays good. the kids just continue to eat the corn <clears throat> while I cut it off. My corn. Nathan loves corn. He will eat corn with almost every meal. Yeah? Is that some good corn? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mommy did not just because I do. I doing dip, mommy. Mommy, look. <laughs> I doing dip. He loves his corn. <clears throat> I plan on losing a lot of corn in this process. I have lots of corn. Look at that. I think you only have that jar right there left to do. How you doing on that? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Good. All yeah. right. <clears throat> And then I'll just take this corn and I'll put it in the jar and fill it up with water. Mom, we got lots of corn in here. I only have one ear of corn and half of it's already gone from Nathan. You want some? No, thank you. Mm. Oh, you like it? I want to it now. I want to right. it, mommy. <laughs> nope, we don't need any more salt. One more good. Okay. No, they're, they're all, all the jars are all filled, okay? One so, more, no, not be it. You're going to oversalt the corn and it's going to be not nice. All right, there we go. I'm going to no, take this. Don't eat the corn. <clears throat> All right. And I'll bring you back, hopefully, when I have Mom, corn in jars. This is our first bowl of corn filled. I just cut to the chase and gave Nathan a whole ear of corn. He's over there happy. But we're just going to take this corn and we're going to no, put don't it. Help, mommy. Put, put yours in, please. Okay. okay. That one be rude and it would be mine. Perfect. Sounds like a plan. <laughs> and they would mind, they would mind, they would mind. And they would eat mine. And we would do D. And yes. I did that one and that one there. Okay, mommy? Alright. That's mine, okay, mommy? And you stop showing me and you start filling your bowl. Huh? Or your jar. I went fast. Don't go fast. Look, you just spilled. Clean that up. You don't want to waste any of the corn goodness. Like that. Oh, like that. Your jar is not full. Mine's almost full. Uh, Look at that. So how can you? on camera, mommy. Because you're going fast. Go nice and slow. Mom, come on this side. We'll just eat some too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Come on, little baggy. 
Yeah, I have a lot more porn, girlfriend. And this, this is only six ears cut. This is only six ears cut. Okay? We got we got forty more. Can I pick it up? No. Why? No. Why, mommy? Because this is gonna stay here so I can cut corn. <clears throat> My jar is full. You wanna fill your jar, please? It is full now. I mean, this is not What's full. That? This is full. See how it's at the bottom of the the rim here, of yeah. this first line. That's where you got to get yours at, and then start taking and this and fill done, another done, one. Now done. <clears throat> done now? Yes, that one's done. Now start filling that jar. Uh, mommy, there's no more. No, nope. one down here. Don't take this out. There's no more. All right, you do that. I'm gonna take another ear of corn. I'm gonna separate Bye. it for the chickens and for the pigs, okay? Bye bye. Sound good? Yeah. All right. Bye. Have fun in the rain, Nathan. I don't wanna go on it. Yeah? some more corn off for you, okay? So you can put it in your jar. Put more in my hands. Uh, no, your hands, they're icky with corn. It's okay. You're gonna wash them and come back and do more corn? No. I'll try to do more corn. Okay. Mom, I don't need something, Mommy. In the drawer, Mommy. Oh, no, don't go in that drawer. I got a whole bucket there. I need this for me. You need the tiny spoon for the corn? What do you need the tiny spoon for? The corn. You're going to scoop up one ear of corn, or one kernel of corn at a time? Yep. So cool. This All is right. so Last year I kept all the cobs and we made corn cob jelly. Well, needless to say, we only went through about half of it. It is really good. If you have not had it, Make corn cob jelly. <clears throat> this year, we have a friend who has pigs, so they are just no, gonna go no, like to the corn. pigs. Yeah. Yeah. And again, about my corn, I have to soften the left two door. Okay. For what are, what, what are the two pig. pigs' names? Jordan Papa. Oh. Jordan Papa. Jordan Papa. All right. Perfect. I'm gonna keep cutting corn. Papa Joe. Yeah, we got a whole bunch. Want some corn? It's on the floor. Eat it. Oh, it's dirty. <laughs> ah, that's right. It is. But mommy's got jars. On the We're corn. gonna pick it all up because we made a mess. Yeah. Oh, we mommy made a mess. Grandma didn't. So grandma not no, have to. I didn't that. make this mess. I got all this hair stuff. See, all for the chickens. No D for the chicken and dough for the pig. That's right. Then we got that one already filled up for the pigs. Mom, that one for the pig. Yep, that one's for the pigs. Yep. That one for the pig. What? See, we got this for the for us. This one and two more. It's done. All right. Yeah, quite a few buckets. Mm -hmm. That one 
pig, chicken, pig. Yeah. Chickens are gonna be very happy. Oh yeah. Chickens. Pigs will be extremely happy. I don't think they ever ate anything like that yet. Uh, the chickens, yes. The pigs, no, because no. they're still babies. Okay. But they will enjoy. Likes it. There's Belle and LB and Kara. Alright. Pecking at that corn. I put the rest of them in the freezer and give them to them periodically so they can sit and pick out those cobs. And once they pick out all that corn out of those cobs, let the cobs dry out and use them as fire starters for our Summer campfires and roasting marshmallows. So I like to stay outside in the rain. All right, Belle, eat those silks. Perfect. I'm left with yummy corn juice. I'm going to divvy it up into the jars. Why waste the corn juice? It's flavor. This corn was so juicy, so fresh, so good. Nathan ate two ears. Madison picked at a lot of the corn I was cutting off. So I am, oh, all right, I am four jars short. Because Nathan ate two ears and Madison ate some out of the bowl. I'm going to put that on the stool there for a minute. And I'm going to wipe all these rims. No, wait. I have to add water first. That's what I got to do. Let's take my water. Pour that in there. Madison already put my one-fourth cup of salt in there. You don't have to. It just adds a little bit of flavor. I got this bigger one for the canning, but oh, it is heavier. So I don't have to wait as many times for this to fill back up. But my small one, because I knew this summer we'd be canning a lot. We canned a lot last summer, but I plan on doing twice as much this summer with this harvest. And especially when you catch these deals. 10 ears of corn for a dollar. That is crazy. Got all these jars filled up with corn. Corn, salt, and water. Can't beat that. All right, even though I got a bigger one, I'm gonna need to put more water in here to finish my last four jars. All right. Well, that is filling back up. Let's wipe these rims and get some lids on. Start filling the canner up. You always wanna wipe these rims, make sure they are nice and clean. Don't want to go through all that work and 
have them not seal. That'd be horrible. Oop. Okay. That dunked in the water. Can't wait until the day when I have more than one canner. I'm saving up for another one. And I can have two batches going at the same time, and then I could do bigger batches. But right now, I'm still at one canner load batches at a day, so I'm still doing small, small batches. But it is batches nonetheless which is still good food, non-processed food, healthy and wholesome food on the table for my family, which is always a plus and a win. Plus and a win in my book, right? Unstick, unstick yourself. There's two. There we go. Like there's two stuck. I did not. There we go. All right. That is also a glorious, gloomy, dreary, blustery. somewhat cold day outside. I bet Eeyore would be thrilled on this day. I say my chickens aren't. <laughs> They're in the run, staring at the rain, going, stop, I want to go eat the bugs. The ducks, though, are happy. They're, they're waddling their little butts out in the rain, flapping their feathers. Laughing at the chickens that are stuck in the run. And all the lids are in. Except for my last four. I'm still waiting for my water to finish filtering over here. But I'm going to start putting on rings. My rings are kind of tarnished and discolored because we got hard water. But if they go on, finger tight, there we go, <clears throat> um, they are good to go. As long as they go on, you can get them finger tight. Remember, it is a tool. We are not wearing them as jewelry. So they don't have to be pretty and shiny. But if you have hard water, like I do, and you put a splash of vinegar in your water to prevent the hard water buildup stain all over your jars, they will tarnish your rings faster. So they're not going to be pretty. But, and this, I got one more to put on. Didn't go on. There we go. All right, and now off to the canner. All right, I'm gonna pressure can this for 55 minutes. Double stacked. Perfect.